Hey everybody, uh, we're gonna do a series of how-to videos for like the basics of brewing, uh, and today we're gonna start off with milling. Correct. Yeah, so with milling, um, every now and then we see a lot of uh, new home brewers asking what happened to the efficiency, was too low. Obviously there's a lot of factors that uh, affect your efficiency, uh, like water pH, there's other examples, but the first one is uh, how you mill the grain, right? Uh, I've used the Corona mill in the past, but it crashes the grain too much, so you get too much flour, uh, when you get too much flour, you get too much tannins. Uh, it's not ideal, and uh, sometimes with the Corona meal, uh, you get so many full grains, which again, it's gonna drop your efficiency. So today I'm gonna show you, um, we, we're having a brew day going on, so I'm just show how we do our, our milling. Sure. Just have a look at the shots, and I'll come back at the end just to tell you a bit more. Uh, today I'm gonna show how we mill our grain when we brew. Uh, I have here a two meal, uh, two row meal, uh, but there's obviously uh, three, uh, three row meal in the markets, but today we're gonna use just a, a, a two two row meal, and I'm gonna meal my grains for a brew day tomorrow, and I'm gonna sh uh, I'm gonna show you why you need to uh, what you expect when you meal your grain. Okay, so the milling is done. Uh, that's what you look after when you uh, meal your grains. Uh, you want to expose the inside. That's all you need. Uh, let's see if I can get a close up here. So basically, you almost can see some whole grains, but when you pick them up, just to pick one up here, you can see it's uh, broken. So that's what you want. So you don't want that too fine. Uh, if you have too fine, you're gonna extract some um, tannins from the, the, from the husk, and you, you're gonna end up with an undesired flavor, a bit of tannins. Uh, and uh, having the grains like this is also gonna help you a lot uh, during the lautering, uh, you're gonna have a nice filtered beer and nice clear beer. So you don't want too much flour because also you're gonna end up with a, a stuck mesh which might be a pain there. So that's a, a simple video. It's just to show how we uh, how we mill the grain and that gives you a perfect and a good uh, efficiency. Yeah, so that was it. Uh, like we said many times before, it's a very simple video but we still see a lot of uh, new home brewers asking about it, so we just try to make a little bit clear for you. Uh, if you like the video or if you wanna see more videos about how to brew, like for beginners, uh, just like us, subscribe, turn on the notification, is yep. that right? And let us know, let us know if there's any other videos that you'd like us to try to do for you know, um, introduction, intermediate, whatever you like. That's it. Let's go. Thank you guys.